Please welcome Maya and her mom, Tanya. New this morning, a local teen still battling a tumor has, that he's had for most of his life. Now, this month is NF Awareness Month. NF is a genetic condition that causes tumors to grow on the nerves. Emily Barron is a freshman at Northview High School in Sylvania. The teen has been through a lot in her short life, but she and her family are focused on being part of helping unlock the answers about a disorder that has no cure yet. There's a boy, he sits alone. Every day, every lunch, every class he's ever known. He sits against the wall, nobody sees. He lives a life you couldn't believe. There's a girl, she can't help but give in. Awareness helps organizations like the Children's Tumor Foundation raise funds for critical research to develop effective treatments and one day a cure. Hereby I proclaim May 2024th is Neurofibromatosis NF Awareness Month and Friday, May 17th, 2024 is Neurofibromatosis NF Awareness Day. So many people alone and feel lonely. So many people are hurting far past than what we can see, but they're trying their fight. Hi, my name is Maggie, and I have NF1. It is important to make neurofibromatosis, also known as NF, research visible. I have NF1, so what does it mean if there's a break for NF research? Well, it's like winning a lottery. Also, no more surgery and no more pain. We need to be able to teach other people who don't know about the condition, about the condition that we all have. I want you to see me and see NF. Thank you. It's been a rough road. Gone through a lot of medical procedures. Struggled a lot with those when I was younger. Just go you know, every three months to go get blood drawn, MRIs, and cardiograms, all the works. So coming here today and now graduating soon, it's <laughs> it's a big deal. When you have to deal with something really bad, you can't always let it get you down. We got bulbs and we went knocking at the neighbor's doors. And I told them about the NF1 and 